Yeah, you want to follow everything for Los Olas. Jim and Janine here in Fort Lauderdale. Let us show you the town. This is a fun part of Los Olas. There are a lot of nightclubs, stores, boutiques. I even see some art galleries. Jim here, outside the Riverside Hotel. One of the great places to stay in Fort Lauderdale. Let's see how it stacks up. The Riverside's divided into two different parts. A historic 1930s hotel and a later built high-rise tower. But this place is a gem of all gems in Fort Lauderdale. Nice looking around. Riverside has a great gym. Very nice. And they offer waterfront dining here at the Riverside. Very relaxing. Look at all those umbrellas. Watch the boats go by. They have an open air bar. Kilwins has a great location here. Look at those candy apples. And listen to the festive music here at El Camino Mexican restaurant. This, this place will be happening in a couple more hours. Actually, it's happening even now. This might be fun for dinner too, you know. I know. Mr. Daniel's car, the chuck wagon, it was an El Camino. Where to next? <laughs> Let's go. Okay. A lot of stores and antiques here, too. Actually, this looks more enjoyable. Like, more enjoyable. Hey, there's something happening here. What's the name of this place? Walrus Wild. Oh, look at the multicolored macaroons. I see. Look, they got sprinkled macaroons. They look like Oreos with sprinkled. Okay, would you sit with me? I would love it from here. Do I have to sit here? Are you going to sit at a table? Yeah. Do you have iced coffee? Yeah, it's all on the menu. Okay. So, Bossy has opened up another location. Not in Fort Lauderdale, believe it or not, but it's in Boca Raton. This is the venerable Fort Lauderdale site. My wife likes Yetis. It's like expensive picnic coolers. Oh wow, this must be really popular. Yeah, this place is about seven years old, the Floridia. Notables from Bob Hope to presidents at all the Floridian. Good morning, how are good you? Good morning to you, how are you? They say people party all night along Los Olas. Come in here about two in the morning for breakfast. Oh wow, look at your food, Janine. That's an amazing looking omelet, man. Whoa, look at this. Okay, well, thank you. Oh, my pancakes look great. Look at all the celebrities here. Was there all the celebrities here? Yeah. Yeah. There's George Bush up there. I saw Bob Hope. Biden. Ricky Mano. This is Rocco's Tacos. They're getting ready to build one by the UTC Mall in Sarasota. <laughs> yeah, so you should be tired of it, right? You eat it all the time, so that's I, good to I know. Don't. Right. I, I don't get tired. You really is. Now, what about you? You got married today, would you try the light pink? Mm -hmm. really no, okay, now we're doing the trifecta of Lily Pulitzer. This time, I'm Los Olas. What's really interesting is that a road passes over the Henry Kinney Tunnel. You would never even know there's a tunnel going underneath Los Olas. You know that? I don't know. I oh, because it's... of construction, that's what's going on. But this, this is how it used to be here. I'd like love all off. You see like this antique stuff? Right. You know, brick wreck. Across the street is the classic American Social Club. American Social Bar and Kitchen is still popular. It's been here for years. Live music and Tommy Bomber.
Another popular spot is Cuba Libre. There's a certain mystery. I love this guy's music. He's playing with his heart. So relaxing to walk the streets of Los Olas. Town Bakery looks like it's doing some business tonight. Big city, not so much. Hey, Los Olas has many wonderful restaurants. It's also known as a shopper's paradise. Hey, check out all the cafes, boutiques, and galleries along Las Olas. This guy knows how to play. Romance. Los Olas. So romantic here. Hey everybody, we're gonna show you how to party on Las Olas tonight. You with Jim and Janine on the Tide Island Channel. Las Olas is a grand boulevard in Fort Lauderdale. Fun in the sun during the day on the beach. Party on Las Olas at night. Dozens of bars, restaurants, and live music. Now we're heading east on Las Olas. Past uh, Tommy Bahamas. They sell a lot of clothing, but they also have their own bar. Man, this place is wild. They sure know how to party in Fort Lauderdale. I love this look, the Cuba, Cuba Libra. Art museums. Lights of Las Olas are breathtaking. Beautiful stores, fine shopping permeates this place. Definitely one of the most happening restaurants in all four. Lauderdale, Las Olas, El Camino, fresh ingredients, great tacos, and enjoy the experience. Everyone looks so happy here. Nice looking ladies' clothes. Oh, look at that fudge you're making. It looks great. And look at the atmosphere. You almost feel like you're in Havana. Look at the Cuba Libre outdoor restaurant and bar. Very authentic architecturally. See the riverside at night. Definitely the best location in Los Olas. One of the better ones in Fort Lauderdale. Now you're hearing the music and the vibe from American Social. They have TV, they have watch sports, but they also have a pretty active bar and kitchen. Known for the burgers. Tommy Bahama even has a place too. Go champ. So 
a lot of good looking people there. Come on, champ. And hey, look at all the fresh gelato, the gelaria from Tuscany. I think it's in Italy. He says, "Hey, come on, champ. Leave these people alone, buddy. Come on, let's go, buddy." Oh, the, the vibe is very cool at the big yeah. city cavern. Oh, nice looking real estate over there. I love those causeways. Royal Palm Drive. The Los Olas neighborhood used to be home to some famous people, including Connie Francis, Lucille Ball, and Johnny Weissmuller. In case you're wondering, Las Olas means waves in Spanish. I love Venice. I love that pink one, Jim. Right. I think it's amazing. So if you like this video, hit like, subscribe, and comment.